Hey guys, it's Andy. I just wanted to touch on what is going on with the 14 Days of Self Love series. Is it over? Why did I actually do it? So, the first thing I want to tell you is why I actually did it. I did this series obviously because self care is important and because I am painfully single and wanted other options. But I also did it because I wanted to see if I put more videos out in a month, would that change my channel's performance? Would that get me more views, more likes, more comments? What would it do? Would it get me less than average? I'm not really gonna go into what it did. I noticed that I didn't do much different. If anything, it got me the same amount because none of the videos had time for people to like catch up. Catch up. But basically, yeah, it didn't really do anything different. And because the videos were shorter, so it actually lowered the amount of watch that I got. I also did it to challenge myself. I felt like putting out one video a week wasn't enough and I wanted to give myself more of a challenge. And I wanted to see just how much content I could really push out and still make it good quality. Through doing this, I found out that one, maybe two a week would be doable, which we will get into later. Like with the 14 Days of Self Love, if I had messed up on some footage, I would barely have time to read film because I was under all this pressure to get a video out, get a video out, get a video out. And then because of that, they got lower quality, which gives them lower views and, and all that, blah, 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 blah. So I also wasn't really taking care of myself because as I just talked about, there's all this pressure that I put on myself to put out more videos and put out content, write, film, edit, repeat. So every time I finished a video, I would upload it as soon as I could, right after it finished exporting. I wasn't actually like taking part in these self-care activities as we can see by some of this footage. This is dangerous. Yeah, it looks like it's diarrheaing. <laughs> that footage which I ranted about on Instagram or Snapchat. I don't remember. So yeah, that is basically it. Um, I know that you guys are probably wondering whether the 14 Days of Self Love event is actually going to come back and how that's going to work since Valentine's Day is over. I personally think it should just be like around the Valentine's season. You definitely need to be taking care of yourself consistently and year round. So because of that, I will continue the series. Obviously, I'm not going to try and put one up every day because that gives me a lot of stress and a lot of pressure, and we don't like that. But that's beside the point. So every Friday for at least six more weeks, there will be a brand new self-care episode. It's one of the ideas that I never got to when I was trying to do the actual series. That is all for this little... almost forgot. Okay, so this Friday, of course, there will be a self-care video. I'm not sure what, what it's going to be yet, but it will definitely be out. But I will put the link right here when it comes out. Thursday, I do have another video coming out. I will be putting out the bloopers from every episode of this series, and trust me, there is a lot. I put all of the footage into my editing program. Over two hours. So I'm going to have my work cut out for me until Thursday. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already. I can't wait to see you on Thursday and then Friday. I hope you enjoy. March is gonna go so smoothly. You guys are not ready. I am not ready either, but I will. I will be since I'm getting this done now. So bye.